used to being rescued. Sir, I'm afraid... Save it, Captain. I know what happened. You let that alien blow up the satellites and steal everything there is to know about S.H.I.E.L.D. Do you realize how vulnerable that makes us? Captain, where are you going? Captain! Let him go. I will talk to him. Steve, wait! Please. Your performance today... It is to be admired. Regardless of... I failed. You are not responsible. The team failed you. Steve, you are someone who gives his all for what he believes in. And whether I get hurt or whether I die, you are a man I'm willing to follow. Do yourself a favor. Don't. He needed this. So did she. I've had a good life, Steve. I'm happy to hear that. Now, it's your turn. To Captain America, the man who fought to the finish defending this bunch of ingrates. I still can't believe it. Those hotshots actually pulled it together. Yes, they did. They had a great leader. You were supposed to call for backup. I didn't need it. This is the last time you do this to me. And look, you're wounded again. Steve, I know what you're doing. Believe me, I have been there. You cannot fill your life with this. It will kill you. Then let it. So what are we now? A one-man army? You left me no choice. Happened to you, son? Why are you such a mess? I'm fine, sir, really. No, you're not. Now be straight with me. Why are you dodging the downtime? I'd just rather keep busy, that's all. You got something against having a personal life? It hurts less when you're fighting, doesn't it? You don't know anything about me. Steve, listen. You've got a right to be a little screwed up after a 60-year deep freeze. I know that you are afraid of peace, because the moment you have it, a normal life seems within your grasp, and you don't want to lose that again. It's time to start letting go. Yes, General. He will not listen, you know. He never does. Steve, things have been strained between us lately, and I... That's in the past. I think we should start focusing on our future. 